awesome question of the day. Can you trust those before and after images that you often see on like social media and the internet and even magazines and stuff? And the answer to this is, well, not really. And it's not because the people putting out those images are trying to be deceitful and use Photoshop and all this sort of things, although that's certainly the case sometimes. It's because whenever we see a transformation, we never fully understand what's responsible for that transformation. Now, in the advertisements, you're trying to be led into the belief that, oh, it's because of this supplement or this diet program or this workout program. And that may play a role and have an influence in that transformation, but it's never the full picture. In fact, it's probably not even most of it. Let me give you the story to kind of illustrate my point. See, back when I started training, I was working with a client named Tara. Now, Tara lost a phenomenal amount of weight and looked fantastic. And part of her strategy was to use this local kind of a Weight Watchers-y sort of club, right? And because she was such a phenomenal example, they wanted to put her in her advertisements in the paper and stuff of, I lost so much weight and everything, and they did. It was great. But whenever I'd see one of those images, because they were everywhere, I always thought, yeah, but sure, she used that program, but she was also training for a marathon and running a crap ton. She was working out with me three times a day, and she was also seeing a specialist to deal with her emotional eating issues. So she had four major strategies that contributed to that weight loss, and yet that company was saying we were solely responsible for this. And it's not just because an after image has so many different influences to it. It's also the fact that whenever you see someone with a particular physique or a result, you're not looking at their current result from their current program or diet. They're looking at the result of everything they've done in their entire life. Like you could be 50 years old, lose weight on a program, but the attitudes and the, the skills and developmental approaches towards exercise that you learned back in college as a basketball player played a role in that weight loss. So no, we never know the full story behind those transformations. And that again, doesn't mean it's being deceitful. It doesn't mean the product is a sham or anything, but it does mean that there's always a lot more to the image than what we see in front of us. Thoughts and questions below. Thanks for watching. Be fit, live free.